kile hatuta kubali ni mtu kujisingizia ati siasa yake imeenda kombo kidogo labda ameshindwa kwa kura ama ameshindwa kwa kesi uende ukafunge barabara uende ukaandamane uende ukavunje duka ya mwananchi ambaye hana hatia mama ama mzee anatafutia watoto wake riziki uko pale unaharibu biashara yake unafunga barabara uchukuzi wa umma unatatizwa hiyo hatutakubali na mimi nataka niseme hivi kwa viongozi wetu wa siasa wote wale wako upinzani wale wako chama ya serikali Kenya hii hatutakubali watu kujisingizia haki za kisiasa kuleta maandamano ya vurugu na fujo katika mahali popote katika nchi yetu hatutakubali we will not allow going forward violent demonstrations anywhere in our country if you have grievances sort out your grievances within the law you can even a few people can 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 demonstrate and say they want something done some people can stand somewhere and uh, announce what they want done but we cannot allow violent protests that we have seen in the past leading to loss of lives looting of shops burning of property assaulting even police officers no country worth its salt is able to permit that kind of behavior kwa hivyo wale ambao mnajadiliana maneno ya finance bill na sheria zingine mwende huko bunge mumalizanie huko wale watashindwa mahakama iko hapo mbele mukamalizanie huko na mtu yeyote asidhubutu akijizingisia ati ameshindwa katika mijadala ya kisiasa ama kesi kotini asidhubutu kuumiza wananchi kwa kuleta maandamano ya fujo na ghasia tutamkomesha kabla hajaleta maafa na sisi hakuna mtu tunaogopa kwa sababu tuko na katiba ya Kenya ndio tunatumia so whoever you are it doesn't matter your stature you can be a very senior politician it doesn't matter we will come for you na sisi hatutafuti umaarufu tunatafuta udhabiti wa nchi usalama wetu sisi zote mufanye siasa yenu kwa utaratibu na kulingana na sheria sio kama tunaelewana na wananchi wanachoka every time oh if we lose this we will go and demonstrate and then you close the city you venture into people's business you are all over followed by goons who are stabbing people and blocking roads no we will not even allow you to enter the streets haitawezekana so ule atawaona awambie hivyo yeah yeah and this is not political we must have a country based on the rule of law meona pale kericho wenzetu wengine wana siasa wanaenda kachochea wananchi wakaanza kuchoma maduka ya watu na kuchoma mashine za kuvuna chai hao ni wananchi au ni viongozi wamechaguliwa na chama cha rais na mimi nimesema wote waandikishe taarifa na kama ushahidi utaonyesha kiongozi yoyote pale alichochea umma kufanya uhalifu awe mjumbe awe governor awe nani tutampeleka mahakamani we'll prosecute them Sijui kama tunaelewana. Kwa hivyo watu wa usipinzani wasiseme sijui minister anaongea mambo yetu kama upinzani. Lazima tuwe na nchi ambayo inafuata sheria. 